Heeman Gaming. Usually I run like little video game review show. However, over the past year, I've bought a lot of gamer subs. I really enjoy the product. I simp for the subs. During their Christmas giveaway, I got myself like a shirt and a fanny pack. I'm not gonna put on the shirt. I, I have some self-respect. Got these arm things. I'll put on the arm things. <laughs> anyway, so what I'm gonna do is I've got every single flavor except one. I don't have the black tea. I don't drink tea, so I'm gonna do that. And we'll start with peach tea. So it doesn't actually contain any tea. Like, I've, I've checked the ingredients. It's got the caffeine and everything, but not any tea. So it's, it's really peachy. The most important thing, I think, with peach tea is that you have it cold. Okay. So, oh, I watched a lot of Pro ZD. He does all those tier lists. And, you know, I've got a bunch of gamer stuff that so figured I could do it. That's good. The peach. I don't want to start too close to the top, but, you know, I actually refrigerated all the water, so that's the nice cold. I, I'm going to be generous. I'm going to go with an, an A. Maybe, maybe it'll go lower. Like, All right, next, number two, Grenadier Grape. Grenadier Grape, yeah. Yeah, it's made by Grenadier Jake, I guess. A lot, a lot they, they go with a lot of people. I don't watch any of the people. Wait, I watch one of the people. That's how I got into the whole thing, but let's, let's try Grape. Alright, Grenadier Grape, what have you, what do you got for us? <clears throat> oh, that's good. Is it better than the peach? I think so. The thing, the thing is, they're nice and cold. If you get the peach even to room temperature, that is not good anymore. But I'm going to say that's, that's higher just because I know, you know, usually it takes me a while to drink this and... The grape will definitely stop being as good. You know, the problem is, is normally, normally the, these are 25 ounce cups. I fill them up to the 24 ounces. This is the first time I'm actually drinking as intended and having it at 16 ounces. All right, what we got next? Ah, black cherry. So interesting thing about the black cherry is I think it was a creator flavor as well, like the Grenadier grape. But the thing is, is I didn't get it when it initially dropped, and when they re-released it, the creator's name had been released? I don't really know. So the thing is, is usually, you know, the flavor black cherry, I don't really like it. And yeah, the gamer subs taste like black cherry. Yeah, yeah. D tier, D tier. I think that's probably one of my least favorite flavors, actually. Lychee's not too. In fact, in fact, let's go ahead and just skip to lychee right now and get it out of the way since I'm pretty sure I'm not a fan. Oh, that looks good in the Emerichu cup. Emerichu, I, I don't know. It was one of the few cups that actually wears clothes, so. So you know how a lot of things in the U.S. aren't uh, lychee flavored? There's a reason for that. This is D tier. Ooh, watermelon ice. This is the first flavor I got because one of my favorite artificial flavors is watermelon. Ah, purple. The color of watermelon. You know, I love watermelon. There's something weird about the watermelon and one, a couple other flavors where they have like a really earthy taste to them. Gosh, I think I like lychee more than that. Disappointing. I don't really want to wear these anymore. They're nice and cool. They kept my arms cool. Maybe if I actually were gaming or working out, I'd like to wear this, but not for drinking gamer subs. All right, what flavor we got next? Oh, cherry lime sickle. I like this one. All right, cherry lime sickle by Sweat Sickle. I don't know any of these people, man. Oh, I love that stuff. First S tier of the night. Easily, easily. It tastes like that zebra gum. I don't taste any cherry, and I don't taste any lime sickle, 
but it tastes like that zebra gum, you know? It, you ever had that? Nah, I don't know. Delicious. All right, what's next? Mango. Let's do the mango. Well, that stained the water fast. All right. What does mango taste like? Dude, using eight ounces per scoop like they want is a game changer. Like mango, I mean, it's, it's one of the lower tier tropical fruits. You know what, I'm feeling generous. I'm gonna go with C. Yeah, that was, that was decent. What do we got next? We'll go with blueberry. I don't think I like the blueberry. Akai blueberry. What even is Akai? Is that just like a type of blueberry? I don't, I don't know. It's, it's Akai blueberry. Tastes like blueberry. It's strong. It's a lot stronger than the others. I don't know. It's not as good as the mango, it's better than the other flavors. Okay, you know what? Uh, mango goes up to a B tier. Okay, I blueberry, C tier. Yeah, I'm comfortable with that. What we got next? I don't want to go to this, the, the lemonades. I got a special lemonade. So let's go ahead and just skip <laughs> to pineapple. Oh, I'm not going to lie, that smelled amazing. All right, but how about the taste? Kind of run low on it. I've got to buy more. Like, and there's a one in ten chance I can get a special edition thing. I, they better give me a special edition. I bought them for ten gamer subs. We'll see if I get the special edition. Because, yeah, easy S, it, A tier, A tier. But don't worry, pineapple will go into the S tier. I got a special edition plan for the end. All right, I've got a couple of caffeine freeze. Let's go ahead and go with Misfit Melon. Are green and pink complementing colors? I think they are. It's green and red. And anyway, funny story with Misfit Melon is uh, I asked them, hey, what flavor is Misfit Melon? Because I'm like, melons could be watermelon, it could be cantaloupe. And he said, it's strawberry and lime. And like, my friend, I believe that is guacamole gamer fart. He's like, oh, yeah, it's cantaloupe. And so let's see. All right. Yeah, it's very cantaloupe very subtle. I like it. B tier. It's definitely above mango. Let's put it, let's put, put it in A tier. I'm, I'm thinking high B tier, high B tier. Just barely doesn't make it to A. Okay, I've emptied the cup skin. The thing is, they don't want you drinking more than four scoops of gamer subs per day, but I don't I don't want to waste any. So I went and I bought all these one dollar bottles from Walmart so I can fill them up, fill that up, and just keep moving around. I like the colors. Next off is another caffeine free, it's sour apple. Don't have to worry about drinking over four scoops if I keep doing the caffeine free. <laughs> Same great subs taste without any of the caffeine. Perfect for late night gaming sessions. <laughs> Joke's on you, gamer subs. I'm ADHD. Caffeine don't affect me. Sour apple. Not super sour, but I do like that. Not super sweet. Not as good as the cantaloupe. Not as bad as the others. Easy C tier. Easy C tier. Next to blueberry. Okay, next to... Uh, Dragon Fruit Punch and Blue. We got to get the eight ounces, because here's the thing. When you buy Gamer Subs, they give you these little cards, and they have uh, little drinks that you can make, like bear, blueberry lemonade, strawberry lemonade, Long Island Ice Punch, Blue Dragon. None of these are that good, but we are gonna make the Blue Dragon here, you know. It's good. <laughs> All right, we only got eight ounces in that, but still can be like, you know, one of the more potent tastes I've ever had of the dragon fruit. Let's what it's like. Look, I've never had a dragon fruit before, but that's good. That's good, that's good, that's... 
Easy A tier. Easy A tier. Blue raspberry is a special flavor to me. It's it's the only reason I have teeth left. I for like all of high school and several years after, every morning I would drink a Mountain Dew Voltage and uh your teeth, you'll lose those if you drink too much Mountain Dew. That's why I really like that this is a sugar-free um, alternate, and they have blue raspberry. That's why I love the Voltage so much. Like, S tier. I, I'm not, I don't even need to drink it before I can tell you. I bought three things of blue. I love it. Interesting thing is it used to be called Blue Raz. Now it's just straight up blue. Mm, that's good. Well, let's get that blue dragon flavor, you know. I'm pretty sure that's good. It's got a nice purple tone to it. That's good. They both complement each other so well. Like, that's an S tier for sure. I don't think it's better than just plain blue raspberry, though. Okay, Blue Dragon's good, just barely. It is bringing down Blue Raspberry, but I would, I, I, no, I would drink Blue Raspberry alone. That's, I, Blue is my favorite, but like, that's darn close. All right, now we got two great flavors that I like, made by Cold Ones. Don't know what that is, but they were allowed to make candy flavors. We got Strawberry Daiquiri and Pina Colada, pretty sure. I mix those up because all I can see is the <laughs> nutrition labels. All right, uh, let's start off with pina colada. All right. Now I know that one of these is gonna be S tier. Are they both gonna be? I, I like. Oh. <sighs> pina colada is S tier. Now I really like strawberry daiquiri too, but here's the question. Is it also going in S tier? <laughs> Strawberry daiquiris by the cold ones. Ooh, I am not doing these drinks justice because I always drink them at 24 ounces and I'm drinking them at 16. They're so much tastier. Do I also give this an S tier? I don't want S tier to get too overpopulated. Pina colada is better, but that, that that's so good! Highest, highest A tier. I can't put you both in. I gotta, I gotta say that one of the cold ones is better than the other. Alright, now for the strawberry lemonade portion of the video. There's a lot of, uh, what's it called? Gamer Sup's lore with their whole uh, strawberry lemonade debacle. So let's start with the strawberry flavors. Got two flavors here. One you can't even buy anymore. It's called Strawberry Burst. And one day they just put it on sale and they were getting rid of it forever to make strawberry. See, it's even got a different cap. I swear the cups are possessed. So first off, strawberry burst. You know, I've never actually had them side by side, so I can taste them. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make regular strawberry too. Okay, so just color-wise, like this one looks better. That's not appealing. It's just, it's just, that's just water. That's thinking. It's like heard of the concept of strawberries, and it's thinking really hard about it. Let's try to taste. Good. Yeah, that's strawberry. It's... I don't know if there's a strawberry soda. Like, it definitely reminds me of strawberry kiwi soda. You know, the Shasta stuff. Oh my gosh, that's a good, that's a, that's the best Shasta flavor. You know, if you had it in the dark, you wouldn't really know. Like, well, let's try this. Let's try, let's try a real strawberry rather than just strawberry burst, you know. Huh, it's not as strawberry. 
it's good. It's a strong flavor, whatever it is. Like, really grips you. I think that one was better. Or at least it was more strawberry. Like, that one... Maybe this one's got a little bit of kiwi in it, because it definitely reminded me of, you know, the, the strawberry kiwi Shasta. This didn't. They were both good. I think as far as strawberry goes, I think... I think I put burst at an A, and I put strawberry at a B. So, there you go. The better flavor is one that you can't buy anymore. What do we got next? All right, this is the strawberry uh, this lemonade segment. So I got two flavors right here. Strawberry lemonade. They said that you could only buy this in the summer of 2022. And it's it, it was still up on the website during Christmas, so that. I mean, thing is, you can get this. Buy strawberry, buy lemonade. One of the, one of the flavors that they tell you you can cook up is Strawberry lemonade. There's a lot of lemonade flavors. They want you to put the blueberry in lem lemonade. Maybe you should. Blueberry wasn't that good. But anyway, let's let's try these. Let's start off with just regular lemonade. Huh. It's hoping for some yellow. It's clear. All right. I really like Gamer Subs lemonade. All right, lemonade. That was called what was called lemon limeade. Yeah, let's see what you got for me. Ah, ooh, ooh, that's even more sour than sour apple. It's, it's good flavor. It's a good flavor. I do like it. You know what? I'm glad that I put strawberry lemonade in S tier and then lemonade in A tier. I can put this in B tier. <laughs> It's it's got the, it's got that old time country flavor. It's like as I said, the other lemonade was smooth. This one definitely has that sharpness to it, that bite. So if you if you like old country lemonade, this is great. You got caffeinated lemonade, like. Ooh, all right. Now we're moving on to creator exclusive flavors. First off, let's go with the newest flavor they've released. Uh, Blowhole Blast by Shy Lily. Don't know what Shy Lily is, but she is a whale girl, so let's put it in the shark girl cup. So the flavors for this are coconut, mango, passion fruit, and a hint of lime. And just look at that blue. I love that blue. That's a, that's a nice blue. So I don't even know what passion fruit tastes like. Uh, can definitely take if, if I concentrate, I can taste the coconut. Can't really taste the mango. The lime. It, this is just like a very tropical tasting lemonade. My right, well, lots of lemonade. It's good. It's good. It's good. Yeah, it's got the same sting as lemonade. I, I, I like it. Uh, a tier. A tier. The cool thing about that one is that it glows in the dark. Her eyes and tattoos glow like the avatar. Uh, next one is this one. It says Blue Raz. This isn't Blue Raz. I, I got rid of the, uh, one, the uh, container that this one comes in. I believe the name of this flavor is Jay Schlatt is Going to Hell. It's Blue Raspberry Cream. So... We'll go and get that. If you know the actual name of it, I'm sorry. I, it, it's a very upsetting name. It's like the gosh dang um, Vaporeon copy pasta. Did you know that in terms of water type Pokemon, Vaporeon is cool? Now, yeah, if it were blue raspberry, it'd be turning blue like. My blue raspberry. All right, right, right. I turned it into purple with the. The dragon fruit. But, how's the flavor of J. Schlatt is a bad person? It's blue raspberry. Blue raspberry is at the top of my ass tier right now. It's, it's good. The cream. Also, you make something cream. It's good. Like that, like, like the daiquiri, the strawberry daiquiri. That was cream. It's good. I put it as S T. As bad as a person as Jay Schlatt may be, 
makes a good flavor. Okay, we'll put uh, blue raspberry at the top of the S tier, and we'll put Jay Schlatt's flavor at the bottom of the S tier. Alright, what should we go with? Let's go with uh, Stephen He's emotionally damaged. I, I, I like to think it's Stephen. He's emotionally damaged, but, you know, Stephen He. It's flavor emotionally damaged. Oh, nice blood red color. I like that. You know what I don't like? Well, one problem I got for a complaint about the Stephen He's emotionally damaged is in. I learned on Gamer Subs that it exists. So I went and watched his video where he advertised it. And it, and his. It, it's one like, oh, Asian parents be all like. And then. But she was like, why don't you do this when Timmy does this and Timmy does this? It's, why didn't you say what your. He says, it's really good. It's like, why don't you say what the flavor is? I had to ask. On the website, what it is? It's a uh, peach and strawberry. Ooh, that's a good flavor. I don't know if peach and strawberry really mix that well. If you get them nice and cool, it's it's a lot better. The thing, um, it's got okay. So I think that peach is a more subtle flavor, while strawberry is a much louder flavor. This brings the intensity of strawberry with the flavor of peach, and I really like the flavor of peach. We start off with peach. This is a really good flavor. I like it. A tier, A tier. I, think, I don't think they mix quite as well, but it is a stronger than regular peach, so I like that. And here we have Russian Badger's Guacamole Gamer Fart, 9,000. What a name! <laughs> uh, this is how I learned about Gamer Sups. I, I, I watched his video. I was, I was actually mad at YouTube when I found his video that they hadn't suggested me him, him to me earlier. I really enjoyed his content. But how about his flavor? You know, one time my sister was coming over to my house and she was gonna get there before me. I'm like, oh, go ahead and help yourself to some gamer subs when you get there. And then afterwards, she's like, oh, I had your gamer goo. It was pretty good. I'm like, gamer goo? He's like, yeah, it says GG on it. Why does it say GG on it when it's gamer subs? Makes you think. Lime and strawberry. This is an S tier. I bought this flavor three times. It is so good. Yeah, I love it. Um, absolutely fantastic. But I've actually hidden the best flavor. Cotton candy. The wise pharaoh of food. Sitting atop the food pyramid. Passing judgment on all the lesser foods. I don't even see why I need to drink this. This is S tier. This is my favorite. So good, guys. It tastes like cotton candy. It's called waifu candy. If you're going to go look for it, it's waifu candy. How do they make it taste like cotton candy? It's water. They made water into cotton candies. The gosh dang wizards. Yeah, S tier, S tier, R tier, triple S. It's, it's so good. So there's my tier list for the all the gamer subs flavors. As I said, believe it or not. Not sponsored, but if you want to buy some, got some codes for you. Use the code RADICAL if you buy some, okay? I, I like, as I said, Badger, you can use Badger. Badger's who got me into it, but RADICAL, RADICAL said I like him, he's a smaller creator, and he, it says if he gets enough, if he sells enough gamer subs, they'll let him put Poppy on a cup, and I need Poppy on a cup, like I need my lungs, I think. You want, you want to see that I'm not sponsored? Here, this is this is the first waifu cup I bought. Yeah, you see in there? I mean, I, I, in fact, I made a meme about how much I dislike this cup right here. You think this is funny? In a cosmic sort of way, yes. Well, Mr. Funny Man, is this how you get your sick kicks? What? It's just an ordinary crabby. Oh my goodness! Twenty-one days. The paint started chipping after 21 days. After um, three months, paint was completely gone. I even I have not used my waifu cups since then because I, I'm afraid the paint will come off. It might be because I left this in the refrigerator. I think the refrigeration might have affected with it. But fortunately, fortunately, their logo didn't chip off. Just the white paint. So, I don't know. I don't know. 
Of course, message to gamer subs. Uh, look, I don't need a creator code, but um, I do need orange. Why is orange not a flavor? Out of all the flavors, you haven't made orange. Orange cream, like seriously, that would be amazing. But yeah, gamer subs. I love it. It's a fantastic product. Gets you the caffeine. I'm more focused when I play my video games. Also, also keto friendly. But it doesn't have to be keto friendly. Here's my concoction of a flavor, right? Like this. I've said that pineapple from earlier. You go ahead and add some uh, coconut cream coffee creamer to that. If you like pina coladas, get co oh, darn, that is good. Step over cotton candy. Actually, no. Cotton candy's still better than this, but this—that's a special treat that just can't be beat.